Everyone in the state just had at least three straight days of 80 degree weather, some places four or five days. And that got me thinking about when the first extended stretch of warm weather typically arrives in the spring. Now here's the earliest in the year that the major observing sites have hit 80. At Pittsburgh, Harrisburg, Williamsport, and Philadelphia, it was on March 8th, 2000. At all the other sites, the earliest 80 on record came in 1990, between the 12th and 15th of March. So basically, we've seen 80s during the second week of March just about everywhere. Now, of course, spring is so variable here that you can get a single warm day early on, but then not see a long stretch of warmth for weeks, even months. So I wanted to look closer at when the first extended stretch of warm weather typically arrives. And given what we just went through, I chose a four day stretch of 80 degree weather as my definition of a warm spell. Now in Harrisburg, the earliest in the year that such a stretch of warmth has occurred was in mid-March of 1990. Of course, three years later at that time, you got 20 inches of snow. The other extreme was 1972 when the first four day stretch of 80s didn't begin until July 1st. It's no coincidence that April and May that year were pretty wet and then Agnes came along in June. So then I took all the years going back to 1900 and grouped them based on when the first four day stretch of 80 degree weather hit. Now this is broken up into half months. So for example, here's the second half of April, first half of May, second half of May. Now the most common time to get the first warm stretch in Harrisburg is the second half of May, with the first half of June not all that far behind. In fact, about two thirds of the years fell in one of these two periods. In only about 10% of the years, did the first warm spell come earlier than it did this year. That would be in March or the first half of April. Now I did the same thing for State College, a place that's representative of higher elevations in the state. And the earliest four day stretch of 80s was in the third week of April, 1976, more than a month later than the earliest in Harrisburg. At the other extreme, it took until July 20th in 1917. Now that's a late spring. If we look at the distribution in State College, it's similar to Harrisburg, just a few subtle differences. First, there's no record of such a warm spell occurring before the second half of April. The most likely time is still the second half of May, with the first half of June a close second. But in State College, there are more years at the tail end. In fact, in about 25% of the years, you don't get a, a four day stretch of 80 degree weather until the second half of June or even later. So at least historically, this year's summer preview in April is kind of unusual. As to whether it says anything about the coming summer, I ran the numbers and there does not seem to be a strong correlation between an early warm spell and temperatures in the upcoming summer. Paul Knight is back with the extended forecast next.